Previously on Sailing in Okinawa, we took Nana, a burned out boat, and we towed it outside of Ginawa Marina to sail it to EA Island. This time on Sailing in Okinawa, we reach EA Island, we make landfall, and we start the process of towing the boat into the island, and we also get to check out a pretty cool man cave. EA Island. After a six hour trip, we finally made landfall. EA Island, known for Mount Gusku or Shark Tip, has a very distinctive mountain on the mostly flat island. Shores of EA Island. We then reattached the rope to Nana after they had dropped sails and we started to negotiate how we were going to enter the port. to me, the plan changed. Once outside EA, the decision was to have a local cell motorboat come out and tow us in. I was a little confused about what the process was going to be here because largely due to my limited Japanese language skills. The idea of throwing the rope off the boat and then having the rope thrown to the motorboat from the sailboat apparently got lost in translation. So, Asato-san, my neighbor at Ginawan Port, who's at the bow of this motorboat, decided to risk some daring antics here with the ropes and here's what happened. Here to maybe grab, throw the rope and grab it from the water, but how do they get those boat foul videos? Well, here's one risky way to try. The rope's free. After releasing the ropes, the motorboat then hooked up the ropes to then tow it into EA Island. We watched and laughed a little bit about how the difference in Okinawa dialect sometimes can cause even more confusion. But everything turned out okay. Outside of EA Island, there is a red and white buoy. It's actually one of the first ones I've seen here in Okinawa. The red and white buoy allows you to enter on both sides. But there is a very dangerous reef on the right. You check out the water in the EA Island port. It's about 10 feet here and it's just gorgeous. Again, the water in Okinawa is just amazing. After we arrived, we got Nana secured to the pier. You can see the Bavaria 33 foot that we towed it with. Then we headed off to get showers and to check out Miyagi-san's really cool man. Today we're at uh, Miyagi-san's um, house and kind of his like his man cave. So he has like all this stuff. Zen. So local, but super happy because this is really cool. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Sashimi, eh? Ah, Jumbi Chu. Ah, Ija. Then, Sometimes, eh? 
、えっと、刺身もいいでもお私も全然平気うん、ますね。何がいやいやお金も何もかも。That's pretty cool. And so he put out this thing where、uh, normally he has like a big fish that he put on here, but he's using this for like a, basically for the sashimi. And so this fire pit's cool. And this is part of his man cave. He even has a bottle in the ceiling. It's pretty cool. But, Next time on Sailing in Okinawa, we'll give you a tour of the EA port facilities where they have ferries that can bring folks from Motobu Port. Then we'll get ready to board、uh, Burgundy, the 33 foot Bavaria, and head back home to Okinawan Port. But on the way, we had some visitors. Thanks for watching.